Hello there. If you're planning to adopt a female whippet, there are a few points you might consider before going ahead with the idea of adopting a female whippet. Let us look at the points. Keeping a female whippet as a pet can have various pros and cons. It's important to note that individual personalities and circumstances can greatly influence the experience of owning any dog. So these points are general considerations. Affectionate and loyal. Female whippets are known for forming strong bonds with their owners. They can be loving and devoted companions, providing you with a deep sense of companionship. Female whippets generally doesn't escape given a chance. Low grooming needs. Whippets have short, smooth coats that require minimal grooming. They are relatively clean dogs and do not shed excessively, which can be a benefit for those who prefer low maintenance grooming. Temperament. Female whippets are known to be more calm than the male whippets, but it depends on training the pet has undergone. Moderate exercise requirements. While female whippets are active dogs, they don't typically have the same high exercise needs as the male. They enjoy regular walks, short bursts of sprinting, and engaging in playtime, making them suitable for individuals or families with moderate activity levels. Adaptability Whippets, both female and male, tend to adapt well to different living environments including apartments or houses with small yards. They are generally well suited for urban areas as long as their exercise needs are met. Caring Needs Female whippets, like other female dogs, experience reproductive cycles known as heat or estrus. So, you need to take additional care of your pet. Sensitivity to cold. Whippets have a thin coat and lack a thick layer of body fat, making them more susceptible to cold weather. They may require additional protection, such as coats or sweaters, during colder seasons to keep them warm and comfortable. Female whippets has the ability to endure more than the male. Fragile nature. Whippets have a lean and delicate build, which means they can be more prone to injuries compared to sturdier dog breeds. Care must be taken to avoid activities that could lead to physical harm, such as rough play or jumping from high surfaces. Female whippets can be more fragile than the male. Prey drive and chasing instincts. Whippets have a strong prey drive and a natural instinct to chase small animals. This means they may not be suitable for households with small pets like rabbits, hamsters, or cats as they might see them as prey. Early socialization and training can help mitigate this behavior, but it may still be a consideration. Female whippet has less prey drive. Potential Separation Anxiety Whippets are known for their attachment to their owners, and they may experience separation anxiety when left alone for extended periods. They thrive on human companionship and may require additional attention and mental stimulation to prevent boredom and anxiety-related behaviors. Female whippets are more tolerant to separation but varies across different pets. These pros and cons are not exhaustive and may vary from one dog to another. It's essential to research and interact with female whippets to understand their individual temperaments and needs before deciding if they are the right fit for your lifestyle and preferences. Heat cycle. The heat cycle in whippets typically begins around 6 to 12 months of age, although the exact timing can vary among individual dogs. 
The cycle consists of four stages, proestrus, estrus, diestrus, and anestrus. Proestrus. This is the initial stage of the heat cycle and usually lasts for about 9 to 10 days. During proestrus, female whippets may exhibit swollen vulva, a bloody discharge, and behavioral changes. However, they are not receptive to mating during this stage. Estrus. The estrus stage follows proestrus and generally lasts for about five to nine days. This is when female whippets are receptive to mating and can become pregnant. The bloody discharge may change to a straw-colored or clear fluid during this time. Male dogs may be attracted to a female in estrus due to hormonal changes. Diestrus. Diestrus occurs if the female whippet does not mate and last for approximately 60 to 90 days. Hormonal changes take place during this stage, and the female may exhibit false pregnancy symptoms, such as nesting behaviors and enlarged mammary glands. Anestrus. Anestrus refers to the period of reproductive inactivity between heat cycles. It is the longest stage, lasting around four to six months. During anestrus, the female whippet's reproductive system rests and prepares for the next heat cycle. Spaying. Spaying, or ovario hysterectomy, involves the surgical removal of the ovaries and uterus and is a common choice for those who do not plan to breed their whippet. Spaying eliminates heat cycles and reduces the risk of certain health issues, such as mammary tumors and uterine infections. Heat management if you choose not to spay your female whippet, you will need to manage her heat cycles. This may involve keeping her separated from intact male dogs during estrus, as they may attempt to mate. Options for management include crating, using a separate space within the home, or utilizing special doggy diapers or protective clothing. Breeding Considerations if you are considering breeding your female whippet, it is crucial to thoroughly research and understand responsible breeding practices. Breeding should only be done with healthy, well-tempered dogs that meet breed standards and have undergone appropriate health screenings. Responsible breeders aim to improve the breed and prioritize the well-being of both the mother and puppies. Consulting with a veterinarian is important for guidance on heat cycle management, spaying, and reproductive health specific to your female whippet. They can provide personalized advice based on her age, health, and individual circumstances. Thank you for watching.